What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to NB Edits. Today, we are up here in the Northwoods of Wisconsin, but a little bit different Northwoods. We are on, I think what we're now going to call an annual trip. We're up here with our good buddy, Jacob Sweary. Okay. We're in Door County, and guys, it's been a long drive, a long day. Nick and I woke up extremely early this morning, had to work, but we are ready to grind. It's been a while since you've seen us. We have been having ourselves a very busy summer. Uh, we've done a lot of fishing, but um, we're ready to just, you know, film an absolute banger. Come out here and catch some giants. That's what this time of the year is all about. It's August. We're going to be chasing giant walleyes. And uh, we've got some interesting weather this weekend, but I'll tell you what, we're going to bear through the winds and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun. Last year, we had an absolute blast. Go ahead and show you guys some footage. We caught some giant, giant fish, um, some big walleyes from each and every one of us. Last year, Swiri pulled two fish over the 30 inch mark, back to back days. It was pretty awesome. So again, we're up here, just got into the boat. We're gonna go ahead, get some stuff all organized. We're gonna head out there, let's go have some fun. All right, guys. Well, made it to the first spot. Not too bad of a ride out here. The wind isn't um, crazy. We'll see how it is uh, headed back in. Going out with the waves wasn't terrible, but now that we made it to the first spot, the boys are already grabbing a rod and uh, fishing. Literally the first spot. Oh, hold on. Oh, Gobi. <laughs> Actually. Oh yeah. Here, I was thinking you were hooked up. There's a lot of fish down there. Oh, there's like I was saying, first spot, that's where he pulled up to. And uh, yeah, that's actually loaded with fish. And today, if you guys have never done this bite, uh, basically it's a lot of deep water, a lot of structure, and you're gonna be pretty much using live scope the whole time. And you're gonna be dropping jigs right on top of their forehead, basically. Intriguing them to bite, we are, Gonna be using shiver minnows, probably mainly, uh, but there are a few other strategies that we're gonna be using. Sweary is freaking out because oh. if you look at that, that's uh, those are all walleyes. So, yes, I uh, wanted to just cut this intro a little short. I'm gonna grab a rod. We got our GoPros already on. We're gonna start recording and uh, hopefully get hooked up. But I will say, every fish out here definitely could be our new PB. So got to keep that in mind and uh, yeah, let's get it started. Is there a good flip back there? Good flip. We had a gold bee. Hey. Doubles off. Doubles. Doing with the Gobi combo, and just decides to. There you go. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, hey, hey! This feels weird. Oh, sorry, you're filming. <laughs> this feels weird. Is it a smallie? No. I hope not. <gasps> Could you see what it was? No. Not at all. Smallie. Did it feel? Wally that was a bass not? for sure. Was it? Probably a 30 inch walleye. It looked like it swam like at the boat or not really. No. I feel like we see a, a decent sized school over getting fish. But, but here's the thing. 
those schools that we were marking earlier, they're just not here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hold on. That's a lot of walleyes. Oh my. Sheep head. I will cry. It's only been 17 hours. I see color. It's only been forever. Oh Let's man. Let's go. I don't even believe it. That was the most rewarding wall I have caught in quite some time. I am, I Woo. tell you what. Alrighty. First why of the day. I don't know if you see behind me, but uh, sun's going down. It's 8 o'clock at night. We got out here around, I don't even know, 3 something. And uh, yeah, first why. Like I was saying, well, I don't know if I actually said, but this body of water where we're at actually is like strictly giants. Uh, so you're you're going to have to work for these these bites uh, but as you can tell first fish of the day and that's like i don't know nice like 26 incher nice thick healthy fish nice and gold i love the colors up here but it's definitely rewarding uh getting that one bite but i'm not gonna spend too much time here quick because we are finally marking fish and uh like i said we haven't caught fish all freaking day but that's why we come out here beautiful fish get a few pictures and we'll send them back all right Grabbed a few picks. Oh my god. I was trying to be graceful. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, he was all fired up. And uh yeah, that was exciting. I don't even believe it. We have been absolutely grinding, but we are gonna spend uh the next long hours out here, not into the night, but like the weekend. So hopefully that's not the last fish of the night, but we're gonna keep on grinding and uh see if we can land another. On. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, Sweary. It's big, but. Yeah, because they should all be moving in right now, in theory. Oh, on the ball! Big. Big? Big. Hold on, watch out, Nick. Am I over you? Uh, I don't know. Hold on. Let it loose. I saw that one eat it, dude. My jig stopped falling. It's doing that thing again. Just put the camera away. Literally saw it eat. It's got visual. It looks nice. Let's go. Look at the colors on that one. Woo! That's a dark fish. Nice one, Sweary. Let's go. Look at how gold that fish is. Holy cow. Holy cow, that is dark. Wow. <laughs> Literally just turned the camera off. Woo. Instantly right. beauty. Come on. 
Hey, you can do it, buddy. There you go. There we go. Hey, just keep hey. on grinding. <laughs> just keep grinding. You got 10 minutes of bite window, fish all day, 10 minutes of fun. Well guys, as you can see, sun is clearly down. It is pitch dark. We have fished for hours. And unfortunately the bite was just a little bit off tonight. Um, I myself did not even get hit once. Luckily, Sweary and Nick did have a couple opportunities and we got a couple nice fish in the boat. Not exactly sure what to expect for tomorrow. The winds are gonna be a little bit crazy, so we're gonna see what tomorrow brings, but we are going to call it for the evening. We're gonna head in. It was a decent day. I mean, we caught some nice fish, but it was a struggle. It was a very tough grind out here today. So we're gonna go ahead, pack things up, head in, and we'll see you guys first thing in the morning. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out here. A little bit tired, not gonna lie, but we made it. Ready to grind out the morning session. It's about 5.30 and uh, sun's just coming up. Winds are gonna be atrocious once we get out there, to be expected. Yep. Um, not exactly sure what to think of this morning. We've got high hopes, but it's gonna be an absolute grind. So, ready to bear the winds. Hopefully we get into some fish. We're gonna get out there and uh, try to make this thing happen. <laughs> My energy drink is filled with hard water. <laughs> Good, that'll get them in. Become the fish. Today's adventure is brought to you by Ghost Energy. Legendary energy. Epic focus. Epic. Wait a minute. You said a fish? Yeah. It like hit, but then I like, I don't know what happened. And then he came back. This feels like he's not doing anything. Did I snag him? I snagged him, that's why. Or is it just wrapped? Oh, he could be wrapped. It felt like something weird happened. Oh. No, I actually snagged him. You're good at that. But it felt like he hit, and then it, like, Stay I missed back. him. Or you, like, and then I reset it on him. Well, technically, first walleye, day number two. Uh, not really sure. He came in with it on the tail, but felt like he actually hit it, and then missed, and then uh, I, like, re-got hooked up, and that's when I had him in the tail, so I don't know if... That was just when he was swimming away, but first one's like 23 incher. Not really gonna count it, but at least we know we're after the right species in the area. We're marking a decent amount of fish, just obviously uh, it's been a struggle trying to get them to bite. And uh, that one, that one bit in the tail. So next one we're gonna try to actually get in the mouth and hopefully it's a little bit bigger. Feels nice, feels heavy. Here we go. Oh, this is heavy, dude. 
Okay, hold on, everyone. Nice. Bigger than yesterday's for sure. That one got me a little nervous. Let's go. With these big waves. Oh man. That's a nice fish. That's a nice one. There we go. Not a super long fish. Maybe 27. But super, super thick. I mean, this is easily an eight pound fish probably. Just absolutely built different out here. These are the fish that we're chasing after. It's been tough guys, but I don't know. Yesterday we didn't get any to bite during the day, so the fact that we got one already to eat is a good sign. Maybe we're figuring something out, but nice fish. Still got a lot of daylight left. Hopefully the wind doesn't blow us out. It's actually not as bad as we anticipated, but man, super, super thick fish. Nice and gold. Hell of a fight too. God, this fish is so fat. There she goes. Let's go, brother. Back to the deep. Nice job. It's uh, been probably, uh, it's probably been about four hours since I caught that last fish. And since that fish, um, Squeery's hooked up once. And that's it. That's the end of that list. So, <laughs> pretty short. And also what has happened is the wind has definitely picked up. We're pretty close to shore in this spot. Um, mainly because you just could not get out to the main spot we started at today. There's probably like five, six footers out there. But uh, yeah, I think this is where we're gonna call it. Um, the rest of the day is supposed to be blowing pretty hard all the way into the night. So probably will not be back out here which is unfortunate because we have plans on fishing all day today but we gave it an honest effort we definitely tried and uh yeah i can't believe it i was the only one to catch a fish today i really didn't think that was gonna happen i mean i'm always pretty confident in myself but anytime it was sweary i figured he'd be the one that's cracked but uh you know that's just the way it goes uh conditions are tough and it's just we're not biting so that being said we are going to put the camera away now and we will talk to you guys when we get out of the wind back at the shoreline alrighty guys well we did the dang thing it's time to pack things up we've got pretty much everything loaded up into the truck just wanted to say thanks so much for joining us on today's video it was an absolute grind being out here we want to thank Sweary for getting us out in the boat and uh, putting us on some fish we had a great time but guys it was a grind honestly it was really really tough I myself did not even catch a fish the entire weekend but again Luckily, Nick and Sweary were able to get some reaction bites. That is the key to success out here. We were throwing the shiver minnow. The reaction bite was the only bites we got. Um, we threw a couple other things at them. Massive schools of fish, big pods all over the place. But yeah, we had a lot of fun. Unfortunately, the winds are going to keep us off the water for the rest of the day, the rest of the weekend, and we are going to be heading back home. But again, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Apologize in advance for the audio. I'm sure that there's probably a lot of wind noise, and hopefully we won't have any more of that going through the rest of the season. But again, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to slap that thumbs up button for us. We'd really appreciate that. Anybody new to the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button if you guys like watching. Big walleyes, hit the deck. That's what we're all about. Again, if you guys enjoyed, slap it with a like, and we will see you on the next one. Tight lines from NBA Edit.